Monet was a key figure in the Impressionist art movement of the late 19th century. Impressionists were very interested in studying the effect of light on surfaces. When Monet began painting with the unusual colors and broad, rough brushstrokes of this style, he and the other Impressionists were deemed as very unconventional, even shocking, and were mocked by art critics. As the decades passed, Monet and his style were embraced by the public and critics. His success was so great that he was able to travel for his art. In this painting of Waterloo Bridge, Monet visited London, England, and stayed in the famous Savoy Hotel along the Thames River. It was here from his fifth floor balcony that he painted over 40 canvases of Waterloo Bridge in order to examine the ever-changing light and the perception of color. Because the effects he was trying to capture were fleeting, he would quickly work on the canvas on his balcony and then ship them to his home to complete. The scene we are presented with is a bustling morning commute with traffic moving across the bridge and smoke billowing out from the factories on the other side of the river. Monet painted this in 1903, decades before the World War II bombing of London destroyed many of the buildings you see in the background of this painting. Monet was a master of color. His complex combinations and palette are challenging to photograph, so it's best to come see this painting for yourself.